In previous videos I talked about sets, showed the basic operations like how to add and remove elements from set, how to check whether a particular element is available in set or not, how to calculate intersection and difference between multiple sets and so on. You can find the links of these previous videos in the description below. Today I will talk about weak set. Weak set is a collection of objects and each object may occur only once in the weak set. It's just like a set, but with two main differences. The elements in the weak set may only be objects. They cannot be arbitrary values. They cannot be primitive data types. Only objects. And the objects in the weak set are held weakly, meaning that weak set saves the reference of the object, and if there is no other reference on this object, it will be garbage collected. And because of these, weak sets are not enumerable also. If you don't want enumeration of set and you have guarantee that set elements will only be objects, then you should use weak set over set. Creating weak set is just like a set. You create with weak set constructor and optionally you can provide an array of items in the constructor as the first and only argument. Uh, as I mentioned before, the elements of the weak set can only be objects, but let's see what happens when we try to put their numbers. We have an error, invalid value used in weak set. So we can push it there, uh, an array where each entry in the array is an object. And this will, this will give me a, a weak set Let's, let's try what happens when, when I have name and another, the similar object. Okay, um, when you print your weak set, it, it looks like empty, but actually this is because we cannot iterate our weak set, weak set and we cannot print the uh, values like an array. So we can check whether my element is available in my weak set or not by calling a has method. Better if I take my uh, objects and create a new object A is this and B is this, basically the same objects, but they are different. Um, A and B are different objects. So I'm passing A and B here and then I am checking um, if set has A and this gives me true. If set has B, this will give me also true. But if I add only A in my array and check if B is available there, this will give me false. Also, if I check if this object is available in my set, this will give me also false because my past object is different from this one. Also, uh, also that they look similar, we have the same name and same key and same value, these objects are different um, different in terms of uh, a reference and weak set uh, works on objects and checks their references. This is all about set and weak set. Um, in my next video I will talk about uh, map and weak map. Um, thanks for watching. I hope uh, I helped you understanding what is a set, how you can create set in JavaScript, um, how you can create an intersection of two sets or difference. Um, you can find the link uh, for more information in the video description. I really recommend you check it out. Um, thanks for watching. Please subscribe and like the videos. Leave also comments below. See you in the next video.